But this ain't even about money, y'all. This is about the principle. Now, I know a lot of y'all is following this story with this lady right here, which is unbelievable. And I can't believe what I just heard. Now, for those who are not caught up on the story, Keith Lee, the food critic, all our cousin, went to this lady's business to support her. Um, and he left a large tip like he usually does. Uh, and he left a tip for multiple people for multiple reasons, whatever the case is, right? Your job was to disperse that money to the people it needed to go to, right? But see, your greed got the best of you. See, if you don't understand, if you haven't been in tune to how the Keith Lee effect works, it's not about what Keith Lee gives you from his own pocket. The effects that happens after that is what the Keith Lee effect is. People start to come and support your business. But see, instead, your greed, your greed got the best of you. And I'm not here to judge, but what's right is right and what's wrong is wrong. Lady, that's crazy. You were supposed to give that barber $1,000. That's what he told you to do. That's all you had to do. But you wanted to keep the money for yourself. I understand, yes, you probably are a struggling business, but that's not how God works. God sends people and things and places. He does these things for people in your position or not in your position for a reason. Your job was to pay it forward. And the first thing you did was show your greed. The Keithley effect is real. But what you did was took advantage of a situation and now it's going to cost you. And it's not worth it. You took a thousand dollars that was not for you and you're sitting up here saying it's not about the money. <laughs> it's the principle. Exactly. It's the principle. You were supposed to pay the barber a thousand dollars. It doesn't matter if they were working, if they weren't working for you. It doesn't matter if they were in a party. A bit. It doesn't matter. R regardless of what you feel, you took money that wasn't for you. You literally took $1,000 from somebody that was supposed to receive the $1,000. And your response is, it's the principal? What's the moral of the story here, people? See, the moral of the story is don't let your greed become your character. Because I hear you saying, oh, you know, I'm a you know, God-fearing woman. I, I'm, I'm God's child. But you've, you did some of the devil's work here now, <laughs> okay? You did some of the devil's work, man. And I pray for you. I hope you figure it out. But it looks like your business is about to be Null and void, baby. Get your shit together. You need to reevaluate your thoughts because that was pretty fucked up what you did. That barber deserved that $1,000. And you should give him that $1,000. Because the Keith Lee effect would have allowed customers to consistently come to your business where that $4,000 could have easily turned into maybe a $200,000 year in business, which is great. But you let your greed become your character. So now you got to deal with the consequences. Self-accountability is super important. And ma'am, you are, you are the donkey of the day today. <laughs> God bless you, love. Everybody comment, share, subscribe. Tell me what y'all think about this, man. This is crazy.